All good. We're back. Uh, yeah. I didn't want to call. Like, are we still alive? And shit? Oh yeah, we're live. Uh, cool. So what happened was I had to go backstage and get an interview with Captain America before this big <laughs> event. And I'm like, what's your plan to defeat uh, Goku this evening? And he's like, well, gee golly willikers, uh, I just got to go out there and try my gosh darndest. And I said, okay. And I was like, my God, you're clean. Oh, you smell Gritty cap. <laughs> Bearded cap. Oh, yeah. He's a rugged man. He is. With championship aspirations on his mind. Whoever wins this goes on to the main event of MWA Colossal Clash to, ch to compete for the world championship. But the loser will still have another opportunity to earn a shot at that title in that four-way ladder match. Figure yeah, they this made is it. not the, the end of the road for either uh, of these two gentlemen. God, how I wish that we could pay boys to men to sing end, end of the road. Mm -hmm. They might not be charting too much these days, uh, though. I mean, plus, there's only three of them now, so, you know, probably save 25 mm -hmm. Shout out. Respect. The guy that's no longer in the group, I think, is the one that did the voiced spoken interludes I really should see if they got if they're hiring right now um, I could do that yeah <laughs> because that's pretty much all he did right? <laughs> pretty it would much. be like the breakdown of the song he'd be like baby <laughs> well fuck you do it your, your voice is better <laughs> well maybe not right now with my nose all stuffed up be like no, baby girl. Perfect. you have sexy phlegm right now Oh yeah, baby girl, you know we're made for each other. I've only got one tongue, and you've got one asshole. Let me tongue punch <laughs> that part. <laughs> oh god, I think I might have blown my chances there. Dude, if that's what boys to men sounded like, I would actually be a boys to men fan. <laughs> baby. <laughs> Let me. You don't like it, your asshole. Wrap <laughs> <laughs> that man in an overcoat. Let me tongue punch <laughs> that fart box before we get down to smashing pissers. <laughs> I'm trying to get suffocated by your sweat box. Oh god. <laughs> oh. Damn, that's gross. Here we go. Oh wow. Easily taken down by Captain, and then power bombed. After we saw Goku dominate his uh, previous match, I did not expect to see this. It's going to be a different story tonight. Captain America said enough with all this anime junk. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, he he was frozen it. before. He was frozen before anime became a thing. Yeah. Good thing. It's a good thing Paul's not watching. He's next to it. I just don't know. I can do that. Oh! Goku DD was not it. Lost Nipping. I'm here. I'm barely here. This evening. There you are. Oh, Captain America just went for a Superman punch and leaped a little oh. too high. That was weird. Yeah. That perception has been a real motherfucker this evening. What's Goku doing? Oh, all that posturing for that? <laughs> that was fun. That was cool as fuck. Well. Goku being a Super Saiyan level dick. Beautiful old school snap mirror takeover. Uh, 
followed directly by an old school rear chin lock. <laughs> Captain America representing the 30s. <laughs> I guess the 40s. I mean, he was alive for both. Late, late 30s, not 40s. Hey, that describes us too. Yeah. Yes, sir. Well, not you. I'm technically in my late 30s now because I just turned 36 on Thursday. Yeah, still. I'm like, I'm late, early 30s. <laughs> like, I'm enjoying yeah. my last few months of telling people that I'm in my early 30s. <laughs> I got to spend my 36th birthday at a campground in rural Missouri being sick instead of streaming on here and getting pity donations from viewers. <laughs> God damn. Yeah, yeah. Daquan, thanks for sticking with us, Daquan. Rooting for Captain America, as I'm sure Jason Fado Russo would be if he didn't have a strange innate hatred for all things video games. What? Yeah, he's old. Um, honestly, I have no idea. I just know that he recently mentioned on Facebook that he does not care for video games. Yeah. Is he single? Is he what? Is he single? No, no, he's, uh... Oh, wait, go, go for the cover. He's married to an attractive lady and... Goes around uh, getting pictures with literally hundreds of celebrities. So he apparently, if you live a really fulfilling life, you don't need video games. But who would have thought? Yeah, no, I don't know. What that sounds. <laughs> <laughs> that makes sense. Oh, Captain America with oh my god, with a springboard into a Superman punch. Captain America just. Running wild. Yeah. Oh, Captain America getting his shit in, brother. Uh, that is a fitting way to put it, considering Captain America and Brian Cage, the man who normally uses that catchphrase, both heavily into performance-enhancing drugs. Certainly. <laughs> Oh, Goku is, uh, spasming a bit. I don't know which, uh, Super Saiyan level Goku's at right now. Yeah, that's hard to gauge with the naked eye. Captain America now ramming Goku's end of that turnbuckle. This is... We're not used to seeing Goku taking a beating. Goku de decimated Shazam in the first round of this tournament. Quickly, he made quick work of Shazam. Easily our shortest match yet. Oh, Captain America saying he's about to put Goku down for good. Oh, and a fucking tornado style donkey punch. Ooh. Tornado donkey punch. Is that going to do it? Stag McKenzie. One, two, only two. Perhaps if he had added another revolution on that spinning donkey punch, he could have put Goku down. Oh, Captain America just walking into the corner for no apparent reason. Captain America searching for the answers. <laughs> That's all oh. I got. I, I figured I'd come up with more to say when I, when I started that sentence. <laughs> I was like, no, searching for the answers is the best I got, dude. <laughs> I'm about to show up early with my headset. Now I'm starting sentences without an empty set. That's how I start all my sentences. The overall, true professional. <coughs> yeah, and I'm the guy that like it's not able to be muted and keeps coughing. Yeah, I've 
got two more shows to call this week. <laughs> well, maybe you do. That doesn't mean I do. Oh, oh God, Captain. I'm 36 now. What do I have left? <laughs> I've pretty much seen all the cool shit I'm gonna see. Yeah, I've seen boobs. I've seen butts. Yeah. I've seen 3D movies. I've gone to WrestleMania twice in SummerSlam. I've never seen the Royal Rumble, so I guess I gotta keep going for that. I've never yeah. seen the Royal Rumble in person. It just depends. I mean, with your luck, it'd be one of those really shitty ones. Oh. Probably. And Goku just got busted open. Uh oh. That could be the fire that he needs lit under his back. Anus. And here we are. Yeah, and he just hits the Misha Goku driver. Hey, hey, yo. How did I miss that one? <laughs> oh it's no, is Goku, he's right going there. for the black mass. Oh my god. Even Sag McKenzie was taken. Had to take a step back from that, but Captain America standing hey, back up. Oh, Captain America blocked the Kamehameha blast. Oh my God, Goku could have probably pinned Captain America. Oh, Goku is doing the fusion dance with the with John Cena. You can't see Cena. Only two, Captain America, fired up here. Absolutely. The main event and the winner gets a spot in the main event of our first ever pay-per-view. Goku, though, firing back with a series of clotheslines. Is he setting up for another black mass here? That's it. Once again, though, not going for the cover. <laughs> that giant swing. No, that'll put somebody in it too. Let's go through. No, oh, that's gotta be all. And it is. Captain America. Captain America put up one hell of a fight. Yes, he did. What a great match that was. That was that lived up to its billing absolutely. Mm -hmm. So now, Ooh. Captain America will compete against the Hulk, Thanos, and Black Panther in a four-way number one contenders ladder match this Sunday in our main event to crown the first ever Matt Wrestling Association World Champion. Goku. Our main event is literally a dream match. Absolutely, Goku versus Superman. That's going to be badass, dude. Damn right. Hopefully we have, uh, or I guess hopefully I have all of the audio shit figured out by then. Yeah, I discovered, I'm very um, sorry. during your audio issues, I checked down detector, and apparently Spectrum Internet's having problems, so that explains my, uh, the issues with the video quality. I don't know if you have Spectrum. Uh, well, I don't know that. <laughs> A bloody Goku, and I'm not saying that in the so British good. sense. No. A bloody Goku has won our main event here, moves on. So this Sunday, seven exciting matches, six of which are official so far, one to be announced. We have that four-way number one contenders ladder match that we mentioned earlier. We have a six-woman tag team match pitting Kim Kardashian, Kylie, and Kendall Jenner against Oprah Winfrey, Captain Marvel, and Beyonce. <laughs> what are you doing, Shannon? <laughs> oh, you just mi Shannon's mimicking the pose Goku's doing right now. Um, and she's also got blonde hair, so it works, you know. No, she's putting it up in there. Throw it up. We have, uh... <laughs> oh, man, I'm so professional, it hurts. <laughs> Uh, we have. I don't think we mentioned this. I don't think we mentioned this during the show yet. Batman versus Spider Man, one on one, in another epic dream match Marvel versus DC, or DC versus Marvel, I guess, in the order I said it. 
And then our three championship matches for the women's title. Wonder Woman goes one-on-one with Harley Quinn. Tag Team Championship. Jay and Silent Bob against Chewbacca and C-3PO. And then the World Championship match main event. Superman versus Goku. God damn it, I cannot wait for that match. That's going to be a knockdown, drag-out match, my friends. Man, that's going to be one hell of a show. Sunday night, right here on the Matt Wrestling Network, 9 p.m. Eastern, 8 p.m. Central, 6 p.m. Pacific time. We hope to see you all there. We hope to not have any of these technical difficulties because, yeah, God damn, great. it's been a roller coaster, by God. Yes, it has. It's been an, an actual emotional roller coaster. But I did <laughs> that whole time I was gone was I fucking cried. <laughs> oh, no, I'm sorry. It's okay, I mean, fucking whatever, you know. Well, on that note, we'll be (laughs) this coming Thursday, another edition of MWF Mattitude. Myself and Red Jed calling the action, but then make sure to tune in on Sunday night for MWA Colossal Clash. We'll see you. Bye, God.